Hey Twink, those guards have stopped paying attention to us again. Let's sneak out of here. We might be able to find some news to help Mario. Do you think it's still safe to use that secret path? Don't you think Bowser's figured it out by now? It's still all right, Twink. Bowser hasn't noticed anything. He looks scary, but he's basically a major bonehead. Let's get out of here. Nice roast speech. Anyway, so um, what's going on, guys? And welcome back to um Paper Mario in the last part. Uh, we finished chapter four in a beat general guy. This part, we might as well do some more investigation now. Um. There's going to be a recommendation I have for this Peach interlude. Um, I just got to load it out really quick because it's on my phone. But uh, yeah, let's just say there's a common cheat to this. Um, we don't have to go through that hallway again, by the way. But um, anyway, so um, I'll, t I'll tell you a cheat to get out of this Peach segment. Go to your clock. Go to the clock app on whatever device you're using. Just go to the stopwatch. I could never do this if I was a kid without a stopwatch or just casually counting, but let's just say there's a uh, counting involved in this. Again, we have to dodge the guards, but, um, now I want to say, um, there's a badge I also want to get, but hold on, we have to go in here. Er, er, who are you? Why well, I'm Princess Peach and who might you be? Oh, you're Princess Peach. Everyone calls me the gourmet guy for some reason. I guess I better report you to King Bowser. You're not supposed to leave your room. But I am really hungry. Tell you what, I'll keep this a secret if you make me something really yummy. So, Princess Peach, what do you say? Will you cook me something or what? I'd love to cook for you, Mr. Gourmet Guy, but I have no ingredients, no utensils. And that's no problem. Oh, that's no problem. There's a kitchen one floor below. It's a five star. You can go cook there. Here, you'll need this. This key will open the door that leads downstairs and so you can get to the kitchen. And we get the castle key. So I'll just sit there and wait for my yummy meal, okay? Oh yeah, I forgot. There are plenty of guards downstairs, so be careful. See, so, yeah, we have to go. There's one room I want to go to d down below, but um, it's not the room we technically have to go to, but I recommend going to this room anyway for completionist's sake. We're going to just dodge the guards really quick. It's actually been a, over a week since I recorded Paper Mario, and I'm a little bit behind on my schedule, my work schedule. I'm recording this is pretty much as the last part goes live. I'm, I want to record more Paper Mario videos. Um, If we go over here. Hello, is anyone in here? Oh, no, I'm caught for sure. Huh? Princess Peach, you're okay. Thank you, stars. You're a toe from the castle. How long have you been hiding here? Well, since Bowser took over, I was so scared of being caught that I jumped into this closet. I'm hiding here until Mario comes and saves us all. Princess Peach, you ought to hide too. It's risky out there. Please don't take any chances. But we actually want to get this chest. The last stand badge, which is when Mario's in danger, he receives half the damage. Great badge if you're using danger strats, but I have to go all the way back and put that in the, uh... I have to go all the way back and put that in the uh, chest. Um, should I cut the footage? Should I cut the footage? I'll cut the footage if I get caught. We're going to go all the way back and basically get that uh, get that back in the chest so we can so Mario can get it later. This is the last badge we can really get as Princess Peach. You can get come back here later and get it as Mario, but I just prefer to get it here. We're going to put the last bit stand badge in. Now we're going to make Gourmet Guy his cake. We're going to make my boy Gourmet Guy my... Boy, gonna make guy's cake. I almost thought I was gonna get caught. Anyway, so what we're gonna do now is we're gonna go into this, um... We're gonna go into this room right here. It's to oh, fuck! That's the first time I've gotten caught in years. <laughs> we'll just show the animation that happens, and I'll just cut back to the, uh... Yep, that's the animation that happens. Are you all right, Princess Peach? Did they hurt you? Yes, I'm fine. Thank you, Twink. That was just plain stupid. I've got to be more careful. I'll be okay next time, Princess Peach. Anyway, I'll just cut till. Uh... All right. So wait till this guy's out of. Wait till this guy's completely out of the way. Yeah. So we, we want to go into this room. It's totally not Womp's Fortress. This is the room Tasty was in earlier in the beginning of the game. Well, here's the kitchen. So, what should we do first? Princess Peach, this looks like a good cookbook. Let's use it, okay? How does it look, Twink? Anything look really yummy? Hang on a second. Oh, how about this? Special strawberry cake. 
Sounds good. Let's whip one up. Okay, Twink, bring me the recipe. Well. Okay, please listen carefully. First, put sugar and eggs in a bowl. Now, you don't have to follow these instructions if you want to mess up the recipe. And sometimes if you have some free time, it is fun to pick the cook the, to make the worst possible combination. Just completely fuck up the recipe. But we are just gonna do this normally. Put sugar and eggs in a bowl. Done. Yes. Okay, let's move on to the next step. Now, mix and whip the ingredients in the bowl. All set. Now, when I say start, please mash, please press A as fast as you can for 10 seconds to mix the batter. Are you ready? Start. Anyway, we have to mash the button for 10 minutes, for 10 seconds. Not thankfully not 10 minutes. That's it. That great job. Did it go well? Prince please? Yes. Now let's go on to the next step. Then put flour and butter in the bowl. Now it is fun to mix up the worst. However, if you cook, if you cook, if you mess up the recipe, gourmet guy is going to spit it out, and you have to do it all over again. So that's why it's like, if you want, I don't recommend just uh, doing the worst pot. If you have a bunch of free time, you can just make the worst possible cake. You just don't advance until you make the right cake. Done. Yes. Okay, after you've mixed the ingredients in the bowl, pour it in the pan. On to the next step. Now, bake the batter in the oven for 30 seconds. This is where I recommend using a stopwatch. Anywhere between 26 and 33 seconds will be acceptable. Okay, hand over to the oven. It, believe it or not, anywhere between 26 and 33 seconds, they'll actually accept it. So, um, we just have to go in between. You can put the cake in the oven with A. Press A again when you think 30 seconds has passed and take the cake out of the oven. You can't redo this part, so be extra careful. Okay, please put it in the oven. All right. So, um, I got to stop. I did not hit A yet. But anyway, so, um, I got to stop. Watch. So, I'll see you when, uh, 30 seconds. All right. It's been 30 seconds. So, um, done. Yes. Now put the cake on the table to cool. Anywhere between 26 and 33 seconds, they'll accept it. Okay, this is the last thing to do. We're going to decorate with cream and strawberries. Let me know when you can all finish decorating. So uh, we just have to get the cream. And the strawberries. And that is a delicious looking cake. It's a fictional cake, but I'm um, done. Yes. Yes. We made it. It looks great. Okay, now let's take it to the gourmet guy. Now, we don't have to get past the guards, thankfully. However, um... Here you go. Oh, I've been waiting so long. I'm wasting away for nothing. Now, moment of truth. Is he gonna like it or spit it out? Thank you. Oh, yeah. Pretty much if you don't bake the cake for the right amount of time or you use the wrong recipes, he'll spit it out. Ooh, that was really good. I haven't felt this way since, well, ever. To show you my gratitude, I'll tell you a secret. One of the star spirits inside Mount Lava Lava on Lava Lava Island, this island is to the south. You should tell this to Mario, but you better tell him that there's also a nasty lava piranha guarding the star spirit. You better be careful. I really don't dislike Mario. That's why I'm telling you this. Wait, did you hear that? Mount Lava Lava, Lava Lava Island, the Star Spears being held inside that volcano. Mario could really use this information, huh? Yes, he could. Twink, I'm really sorry that I kept asking you to do this stuff, but can you go tell Mario? Of course I will. I'll do it right now. I'll be back soon, Princess Peach. What's with all the shouting? Keep it quiet in here. So, it was you, Princess Peach. You gotta keep it down. You're a prisoner, and as a prisoner, you need to keep... What? What are you doing out of your room anyway? Guards, get the princess. No!
Phew, oh, fresh air. After being cooped up there in so long, I could really use some outdoor exercise. My name is Muscular, Mario. I must thank you for saving me. Now it's my turn to help you. Behold. Mario's star energy goes up to four. Mario can use Chill Out, a new star spirit power. With Chill Out, you can lower the attack power for all enemies. Call me whenever you find yourself in trouble. I'll always come quickly to avoid you in battle. Now I'm going back to my dear old Star Haven. Mario! Mario, Mario, I have news. News from the castle. <laughs> Honorable Star Spirit. Hi. Mm. I believe you are Twink, no? You're that young sir who recently ascended from Starborn Valley up to Star, ha Star Haven. What? You remember my name? Haha, <laughs> why of course, we're like family. I, I'm so touched. Ho ho, don't make such a fuss lad, I'm sorry you're going on to do great things. I must take my leave now, goodbye Twink Mario. Wow, I talked with Muscular, the Honorable Star Spirit. I rarely have such a chance, even at Star Haven I'm shaking. Oops, I'm so sorry. I have something, some important news from the castle. According to the information Princess Peach and I got, it seems that one of the star, honorable star spirits is being held at Mount Lava Lava on Lava Lava Island. You wouldn't believe that the princess went through to get such inf this information. I hope it will be of help. I'm going back to rejoin Princess Peach now. Mario, you always good luck. The princess and I will keep looking for useful information. Now... There are only a few things I want to do before I call it a part. Now I just gotta readjust. I do. A, I gotta do a badge readjust. Um, I'll keep HP plus, and um, I think I'll get rid of um, Mega Rush. Sounds about right. I'll get rid of a. Uh, I'll get rid of. I'll get rid of D down jump because I don't need that anymore. And uh, and uh, let's just say there's gonna be some there's gonna be some new badges at Ralph's shop. So um, there's also gonna be some new tasty recipes. So um, we'll do all of that in the next part. I just really want my main focus right now is um, well we'll get the badges at Ralph's shop. So um, there's the all or nothing badge, which is a really solid badge, and um, it basically lets it lets our attack power go up by one when uh our uh, attack when our we get the action command and we have bottle three badges. So um this is where we want to do a badge readjust, a readjustment of badges. So um let's see. Um I'll get rid of HP plus. I'll get rid I'll, I'll get up all or nothing and uh I don't think actually I think I need close call. I'll get rid of zap tap because I don't think I need that. And um We'll keep Quake Hammer for now, so, um... Yeah, so, uh, we, we'll keep Quake Hammer for now, but the last thing I want to do in this part is, uh, buy some badges from Merlot, because we haven't in a while, and we have a decent amount of star... star... we have a decent amount of star pieces. We have, like, 24 of them, so, um... I think that's the last thing I want to do in this part of Paper Mario, so, um... First of all, we have to go get that badge so, um, that we put in the thing as Peach. So, um, and we're going to get the last stand badge. And we're actually going to equip that. So it, basically, when we're in danger, we'll only take half the damage. So we can end up taking next to no damage once we are in danger. So that's another common way to use danger strats. We're going to buy some more badges from... Uh, let's see. Um, let's buy Peekaboo. We're not going to use it, but let's just buy it. Buy, um... Buy Happy Flower. So we, we're pretty almost there to having all the badges from uh, Merlot. We just have to get some more star pieces. So, um... Yeah, I think now is as appropriate time as ever to cut it off on this part of uh, Paper Mario. Let me just recheck my badges see if I'm doing this right. Yeah, so now is an appropriate time as ever. So, um... Next time on Paper Mario, we will do none other than do some pre-Chapter 5 side quests. See you guys then.